Rene, um, here at the Nature Park, it's beautiful, but some people being fit to have seen fit to vandalise the place. You must be disgusted. Yeah, on Wednesday or Tuesday night when we came in, we were absolutely devastated to see the damage that had been caused. The, the thing for us is this centre's been built for the community locally because they've not been on this land for so long. And in fact, many community members of Stamford La Hope actually personally put in the funds to help us build this building. So to see what some of the locals have come in overnight and done is absolutely unforgivable. What have they done? They've broken many of our windows, they've smashed through the main porch door um, and unfortunately with our special bird hide they've broken every window in there which is, um, that's the expensive bit because the, the glass in the bird hide is of optic grade so that people can actually look out and appreciate the bird. So thousands and thousands worth of damage? We're estimating at the moment it could come in anywhere between about £6,000 and £12,000 worth of damage. It, it's not a high street isn't it? It's quite tricky on foot to get to. Absolutely, yeah, it is a remote area and that is another comment that a lot of people do tend to make because you need to have a car really to get here. However, what they've done is they have walked across through an area that is technically blocked off um, at night and come in. The, the, what we're going to do to combat this at the moment, we've put a security guard in here in the evenings, but we're looking for locals to volunteer as wardens, volunteer wardens, to walk the site in the evenings. They obviously get to appreciate walking on the land at night that's normally closed, but they can be our eyes and ears when we're not around and they can contact us, let us know if there's something suspicious and just give a presence to the area. And this Sunday, big clean up. This Sunday we're organising a big clear up. What was used to cause this damage was the rocks that have been left over in the soils from the building. We're asking people to come down, help us pick the rocks up, throw them in the trailer, and we're going to make a big enough pile to pull it all away, and hopefully we're not going to leave anything for the future people to come and smash us again. So what time should people get down here? Any time from 10 o'clock on Sunday. We're going to be open from 9, but we're going to start the, the stone pick up from 10, and it'll go on till 5, so any time between 9, 10, and five. Thank you.